What's up, what's going on legends? It's your boy Earl Shatter here, and in today's video, we're playing some Call of Duty Warzone. Today, I'm gonna be sharing with you guys the best loadout for the M4A1 here in Season 3. I actually changed things up a little bit from the class setup or loadout that I put out last season. So I wanted to share it with you guys, give you guys the update, and across the board, I wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about how important it is to run the extended mags. But before we jump into it, let's go ahead and talk about the class setup that we're running. First of all, we have the muzzle, which is the monolithic suppressor. For our barrel, we're running the Corvus Custom Marksman. A lot of people out there obviously using the M16 Grenadier. This thing actually can ADS about a frame faster. So it is very useful, and across the board, the rest of the stats are pretty much the same. For our rear grip, we are using the stippled or stipled grip tape. For the ammunition, of course, the 60 round mags. And then last but not least, the underbarrel, we have the commando foregrip. So like I was saying, the extended mags is extremely, extremely important. I actually tried running a very similar class setup to what I'm using now with a stock instead of the 60 round mags. And I was finding myself just running out of ammo before I was able to take people out, especially depend, you know, depending on the range you know you would have to stop and reload and it cost me a couple of different gunfights so i of course made that switch so it, essentially if you're not running these 60 round mags at least you should probably rethink your setup you're gonna do a lot better if you make this huge change but across the board you guys should definitely try out today's setup and see what you can do for yourselves i ended up pulling off a solo win with a decent amount of kills across the board we had a fairly good match so hopefully you guys do enjoy the gameplay today as well if you guys do enjoy this content anytime make sure you guys go down below and show your support by smashing that like button let's throw a goal of 10 likes on today's video let's make it easy also if you guys are interested in finding your way back to the channel for more call of duty modern warfare or Warzone content. Make sure you guys do hit that subscribe button alongside that notification bell so you don't miss out on any future videos. Across the board, I hope you guys all enjoy this setup. Thank you guys for all the support in today's video, all the support on the channel, and I hope you all enjoy this gameplay. Okay, we need that guy was coming. Bridge mark, call for fire. This is striker three one, good copy. Strike inbound. Okay, actual. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, we just got some massive air. That was insane. <laughs> I ran over two people. That's stupid. I didn't even have any armor and I challenged that. I was insane. I'm gonna call this baby in. UAV entering the AO. Be advised, UAV is bingo fuel. Enemy UAV overhead. He's in that he's just sitting in that doorway or in that building?
Okay, let's see. Is this guy down here still? See ya. Only ten remain, you're nearly done. Oh man. Enemy UAV overhead. Oof, got out of the car, that was terrifying. Okay, so that's not great for me. Let's go ahead and see. Lion killer. How's this do that? All right there. Yep, yep, that's it. That's game for me, brother. You ain't getting that. That's my dub. So the M4 still absolutely dominates. Very good weapon. The MK2 came in clutch a little bit in that game. That was overall a pretty solid match. I'll take 14 kills for the dub. Still on my hunt for 20 kills in a match, but you know what? Got to start somewhere, right? So, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. You guys are all incredible. And I appreciate you guys for all the support. We had 15 kills. Did I say 14? I don't know. We had 15 kills. That's what it says. So, 15 kills for the dub. Let's get it. Make sure you guys smash the like button if you enjoyed today's video. Hit the sub button if you're new and you want to find your way back to the channel. And don't forget that notification bell so you don't miss out on any future content. Catch you on the next one. Peace!